This video will give an overview of the PC Course Editor software and how it can be used to create content that can be viewed directly on the TBS-1000B EDU oscilloscope. Upon opening the application, you'll see the workspace screen separated into three sections. The lab section, which refers to any type of an experiment, such as analyzing a rectifier circuit or building an A-stable multivibrator. The course section, which is a way to collect and organize labs, and the package section, which is simply a collection of courses. To get started, you need to create a lab. This can be done by clicking the Create button on the lab toolbar. A dialog box will appear that lets you specify a name, the instructor, a date, and notes. Clicking OK will create a new lab that you can then edit by highlighting the lab and either clicking the Edit button or double-clicking the lab. Lab contents are organized using two tabs, the Overview tab and the Procedure tab. The Overview tab provides a place to share information about objectives, required equipment, the technical theory relating, or an instructor's profile. The Procedure tab allows you to define procedural steps that a student should go through to perform the experiment. You can easily insert steps by using the Add Step Before and Add Step After buttons. Steps can include information like how to build the circuit, equipment setup, or instruction on when to take measurements. To help you add detailed information into your labs, the application allows you to easily add images, tables, formulas, or screen captures. Once completed, you can exit the lab by clicking on the Save and Quit button located on the bottom right. Once created, labs can be exported to an XLAB file for sharing, or you can create a PDF file. The next step in the process is to create a course, which is done by clicking the Create button in the Course section. You'll see a dialog box, similar to the one that we saw when creating the lab, where you can add information about the course. When completed, you can see the new course added to the course listing. Labs can be associated with a course by dragging a lab onto a course name or by clicking the Add Remove button, which brings up a dialog box. To make it easy to share labs between courses, a single lab can be associated with one or multiple courses. In the similar fashion, a package can be created by using the Create button in the Package area. A package is significant because it's used to create an X package file, the format required to upload course and lab information onto a TBS-1000B EDU. Courses can be associated with packages by simply dragging them onto the package name or using the Add Remove button. For use on an oscilloscope, a package can contain up to eight courses, totaling up to 100 megabytes of data. To keep track, there is a convenient counter next to each package name that shows its current size. When completed, simply export the package to a USB drive and then plug the drive into the USB port on the instrument. You can also save the entire workspace area onto your computer by using Save As in the File menu. This creates an XWSP file that can be reopened at another time for additional editing or sharing with another user. The Courseware Editor tool was designed to make it easier for educators to create and edit lab material and share that material with students and colleagues. Enabling the lab content to be viewed directly on the oscilloscope provides a unique opportunity for students to get even more out of their lab work.